We're about to get into this sealed $200 Goodwill mystery palette, but let's jump back just a little bit to explain how we got this. So Haley and I just came to the bins, just honestly shopping for personal use. We didn't even make a video today, but walking out the door, we found a mystery palette and they often have palettes like this of like glassware and books, but we're not really interested in stuff like this. But this is mixed textiles, it's $200. And I'm looking at it and there's some purses, there's some hats, but I'm also seeing a lot of these white trash bags, which tells me that these might be just straight unsorted donations that they just got donated and they just filled up a pallet and, and marked it up. So we're thinking that for 200 bucks, this is gonna be a very interesting video maybe. So we're gonna go ahead and buy this uh, and uh, somehow get it home and get it sorted out and see what we're gonna get for 200 bucks. Oh look! Look. Oh, Patagonia, new with tags. New with tags, Patagonia. The good stuff was at the bottom, The good stuff folks. was at the bottom. Back during COVID, Goodwill made a ton of these because they didn't have a lot of people shopping in the stores. And we actually bought 26 of them total. We made a whole bunch of videos on our YouTube channel. You guys can go back and watch some of those. But this is the first one we've done in like two and a half, almost three years. So we are very, very excited to see what we got for 200 bucks today. Hopefully we have a pretty good plan to keep this organized. Cause as you guys see, there's a ton of stuff in here. So we have three different bins. We're going to have eBay, whatnot, and redonate. And of course it's going to take trash up a bags. little bit more than those three bins. We also have trash bags. Cause I'm sure there's going to be stuff in here that just needs to get thrown away. People donate straight garbage to Goodwill all the time. We'll also go back and forth. Cause I know Haley doesn't want me opening up everything. Yeah, I'm too my, excited. By myself. I did, there's a little hat over here. Ugh, it's got some sweat stains, but Georgia, that's kind of cool. I'm gonna wash up. Do we have a laundry pile? Uh, no, but we can make one. Let's I have more bins over there. Let's make a laundry pile. We got three hats here. They all need to be washed. San Francisco 49ers, Georgia Bulldog pinstripe hat, and a Georgia hat there. And again, a lot of these are unsorted donations, meaning people donated these garbage bags to Goodwill. Goodwill couldn't handle all, did all the donations, so they just put them in a pallet and sold them for 200 bucks. So we literally have no idea what's gonna be in here. This one's got something. Oh, it's folded. That's a good sign. We're looking for name brand stuff, Nike or Under Armour, you know, the bread and butter stuff that does pretty well. Old Navy, pajamas, pajamas, golf polo, Grand Slam. Yeah, I think this bag is, I think this one's a bust. Well, uh, it's Izod Golf, new with tags. It's not terrible. Maybe we'll put this in the whatnot pile and then maybe redonate. Oh, there's an Under Armour stretch shirt. Yeah, nothing too exciting there. Out of that batch, one item went to the whatnot box. Everything else went to redonate and the hats went to the wash pile. Haley's gonna okay. take it from here. I'm so excited. We, okay, we've so, actually had this pallet sitting in our warehouse for like three weeks now. Oh, a life yeah, jacket. Yeah, we've had to keep our hands off of it. We have a Stearns. Stearns, Stearns. yeah infant and we also have another one I, yeah another child i throw so, those in the whatnot box probably okay. ava and v which is like target but it's new with tags, new with tags. we'll take that so, whatnot whatnot for sure um and this is just full of socks socks, socks perfect and well this is a shirt simply southern not a great brand like a mall brand in our yeah. in our area Ooh, what is that well smocked it's a very little smocked cute little dress but i don't see a tag but uh. i feel like even without a tag, it's a cute whatnot item. Yeah, it's a larger size, cool color, yeah. yeah. A lot of this stuff is in, like, this is just a bin right here. Somebody donated the bin. A whole trash can? Blue Mountain Blue jeans. Mountain, yeah. Is that like one of the rolly bins? We um, could take that. No, it looks like Oh, like one of the tote. plastic, plastic bins. Little okay, plastic yeah, yeah, tote, But there's a lot of garbage bags in here. Oh, yeah. Callaway. Callaway's good, Callaway whatnot. Brand. All right, we got this hat, custom embroidery. That pretty much ruins the entire value of uh, everything, unless you find somebody with those exact three initials. We'll put that down there in the garbage pile. Got some more jeans, Old Navy. I mean, we'll save jeans that are like Carhartt or you know Levi's or something like that, but Old Navy, probably just redonate. Dickies shorts. Oh, Shein, 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 Shein. Oh, oh, I feel a tag. Kohl's, Nine West, new with tags. What is this, a shirt? Hey, that's, that'll be a cool one, not item. Yeah, Let's see what's in this one here. Apartment nine. Oh, this is vintage Wrangler. Vintage oh, that's Wrangler cool. It has the it's got like curl snaps of, too. Yeah. It's got a little bit of like bleach dye to it. Do you see the little bleach spots? But yeah. it looks cool though. I feel like it might. I don't know. Let's what not that. We've got some new with tags. Walmart shorts, $4.98. Wow. Redonate. <laughs> Goodwill's just going to get this pallet back and resell it again. Oh, we've got an Under Armour. 
Under Armour like baseball tee. That's kind of cool. Women's. That's cool. This looks like it's going to be plush. Plush. So I love let's plush. get into this. I love plush. <laughs> I wish it was a whole palette of plush. Well, first off, there's bras. Oh, nice. Even better than but plush. Hey, sometimes bras can do pretty well depending on the brand. These are Miss Mary. Miss Mary bras. Uh, Shout out Miss Mary. Marie. So there are a couple different. Oh, those are that's underwear. Ooh, great. Uh, fun fact, guys. Nobody wants your old nasty underwear. Don't donate it to Goodwill. Bras, okay. Panties, not okay. Oh, we have Anna, Anna from Frozen. Pretty good find in the panty bag. And we have Elsa, oh, also perfect. from Frozen. Perfect. So if you guys don't know, we sell a lot of plush on Whatnot. So if we pull out a plush out of here, it's probably going to go on Whatnot. Yeah. It's a realistic dog. K&K sales. Dog. Limited. Time only. Play to win. It looks like... Huh. Maybe like a prize or something. There's another one in here. Let's see. Looks like a little beagle. Yeah. Little beagle. Bags Shiloh. Remember that movie, Shiloh? The movie in the book? Yes. Sad, isn't it? Yeah. Something sticky in here, though. Oh, great. Just what we like. Ugh, sticky stuff. Sticky. This is a... Uh, it looks old. Creek Ranch, Colorado shirt. It's not just on a heavyweight tag. Oh. Knox Rose pants. Mm. Mm, well... Redone it. A whole, a whole, whole trash. Garbage. And time and true. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's a flush. I got a flush. New attacks. Nice. Unicorn. What is that? See, it's my turn and you're. Sorry, I got excited. I just saw Pokemon. That's cool. Oh, Look wow. at that. It's an embroidered Pokemon. Yeah. Kid size. Huh. But still a cool shirt. Yeah. We'll put it in the, that, put yeah, it put it in the wash bin. This grandpa is, it is famous. Not your turn. Sorry. <laughs> this not grandpa your is turn. famous for bear hugs. It's a bear hug grandpa sweater. Oh, we got another flush. Oh, it's a. Blippy! I almost called him Blimpy. Blip. Blippy. <laughs> and he talks. All right, that's good. That's. Oh, that's almost. Wild. What is this? Headbands? Necklaces? I think that's a necklace. Yeah. yeah. Two necklaces. We actually have sold a couple pieces of jewelry and whatnot. And those usually do pretty, pretty well. Another little Blippy. Silver jeans. Those actually might be pretty good. This is a leather jacket. Oakwood classic, size extra large. Let me make sure it's, it's actual leather. Yeah, it's leather. It's got some gunk on there, but it's kind of cool. Is it too much gunk or? I don't know. Just enough gunk. I don't know. Muzz, what do you think? We're going to LA Dodgers hat that also has gunk on it. Whatever that is. Yankees, right? Or no, I don't think that's, that's just Yankees. Why. It just says why. A lot of dirty stuff in here. Russell Athletic, whatever that logo is. So. I'll give that bag a two out of ten. I gotta choose wisely. There's some stuff in here. Let's do this. That was nice and nice and girthy. Never know. What was that Chanel? No boundaries. Close. We have a Carolina Gamecocks. Let's see. Cut tag. Cut tag. Doesn't look that old. It's What's a little crackly. Yeah, pretty crackly. Here, Mossimo. It's a pig. A pig. A little stained. What's the tag? Shane Dawson. Oh, Shane Dawson. That's a YouTuber. He's a YouTuber merch. Huh. I don't know if he's like relevant anymore, but that's probably try. that's probably worth something. We have a Domino's Pizza sh a shirt. That's Domino's that could be good. Punta Gorda style rack. Got a jacket. Got a fleece. Is it Columbia? Is it Columbia? It is. Extra small <laughs> Extra though. Small, a little small, but, but that's still right. easy. What not? Fifteen bucks yeah. or so. Yeah. Sherwin Williams. Sherwin Williams. Lowe's and recycle Ray Dunn. How, how appropriate. All right, I see another leather thing over here. Can I grab that? She hasn't said no, folks. What is this? Oh, this is Stephen Barry's size two X hmm. leather jacket. That's not terrible. Real it, dirty. Yeah, it does have some gunk on there. Man, lots of gunk. Lots of gunk. I don't think that's worth it for the amount of cleaning. <sighs> yeah, I don't know about that. Yeah. Let's see if we can go ahead and polish off this top box here. We got a princess, princess hat. Princess hat. Wow. That's cool. That is cool. What not? Is it Rapunzel or is it, I don't know what it is. Some, oh, these little overalls. Just no boundaries, but that's kind of cool. We've got a Tommy Bahama, 100% silk. Like that's a, nice. Like a shirt, a little yeah. button up shirt. It's a women's, I think. It looks pretty small. We'll keep that. Material Girl, Mossimo Stitch T-shirt. Disney T-shirts usually do pretty well for us. That one's kind of cute. Mm -hmm. Seven for all mankind. Oh, those are good. Those are decent. Yeah. yeah. Some shirts. Sorry, it's starting to rain. That's what the noise is in the background. Gaze. What is that? Is that a tank top? Looks like it. 
just a lot of really basic items. But you guys, you're actually really getting a glimpse of what these palettes look like in Goodwill. I think all of us like, like to show, obviously, all of the really good stuff that we get. But, I mean, this is a lot of the stuff that you dig through at the bins. Usually you get what you pay for with mystery palettes. 200 bucks, you know. We might find something good. You never know. And it's a bikini, 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 bikini. Belt. Let's see what else okay, is this in this is box. The rest of the box. Let's see if there's anything. Blacker by Stanley Blacker pants. We got some refuge shorts. There's a spooky little scarf. Hey, it's my turn. Ooh, it's got glitter everywhere. Gross. All these hangers are annoying, but we need more hangers. Yeah, so. free hangers. Free Maybe hangers. we'll get $200 worth of hangers out of here. Maybe. We got some lacy something. Ooh. Yeah, I don't see anything we'll more be super interested in in this box. All right. Let's get this one out of the way yes. and see what's underneath it. Stan will be here since it's got a little flap over here. Before we get into too much more of this palette, I do want to tell you guys that, you know, sometimes our brains are like a mystery palette and we just need somebody to help us get in here and unpack everything and sort things out into where they need to go. Which brings us to the sponsor of today's video, BetterHelp. That's kind of cool, a little uh, modern. It's modern, but Pink Floyd. So I've actually been using BetterHelp for about three months or so now, and it's been really nice. I tried it out because I had, I had this weird thought in my head that therapy was only for people that had gone through some sort of trauma in their life and I've never gone through any trauma but as I started talking to my, my therapist Christy and she was giving me just general life advice it's, it's been really nice to kind of just work through the everyday struggles that we all go through. Is little, that a Disney tea? It's not it's like a oh, fake, Gildan. <laughs> fake Gildan. We got a Packers. Bling. Bedazzled. Yeah we'll keep that one. This feels nice and soft. The lounge life softest fleece but it's like cut the little v-neck. Is like mm. cut out of it. Oh. No, wait, it, that looks like it's supposed to be that way. Oh yeah, it is sewn. Yeah. Okay, yeah. What not? But basically what I'm getting at is that you don't have to have gone through some sort of trauma in your life to benefit from talking to a licensed therapist. And that's where BetterHelp comes in. Got this cool Journey, Modern that's Journey cool. tee. Like the modern graphic shirts like that do really well for us over on Whatnot. Oh, little- Look, Grogu. Little Grogu, that's cute. This bag's been pretty good. I think we're getting to the end of this bag, but even if you're struggling with an actual clinical condition, like you know depression or anxiety, or you're just a normal human going through everyday life, everyone can benefit from talking with a licensed therapist. I'm seeing a lot of like little kids clothes right in here. Yeah, a lot and of I kids think clothes. that we could like, lot, like sell like a big clothing lot of kids clothes on yeah. Whatnot. Like a lot of this, I think this is, this is a brand I saw, Gar Garanimals? Garanimals. And there was some Carter stuff. So somebody could get like a really good deal on like a bulk lot, mm -hmm. especially maybe you sell women or especially if you sell kids clothing. Maybe you're clothing. a kitizen seller. Kitizen, the marketplace for kids clothes. Yeah. We don't personally sell kids clothes, so I'm not really interested in any of this, but we're like only like 70% done with the palette. So there's no telling what's on the bottom down here. So you've got a Lane Bryant sweater. Maybe, I'll say maybe on that one. BetterHelp is all online. You just log on, answer a few questions about yourself, and they use that information to match you with an appropriate therapist in as little as a few days. A cool Chica, oh, no, Cupio. Isn't Cupio good? Cupio, Cupio. Cupio? Well, tie-dye, think... tie-dye dress. It's super easy to sign up and get matched with a therapist. You can do so by clicking the link in the description of the video down below. Clicking that link not only supports us here on YouTube, but it also allows you to get 10% off your first month of BetterHelp to see if getting matched with a licensed therapist is right for you. And BetterHelp is almost like a dating app. So if you like meet somebody and you get matched with a therapist and you just, you just don't vibe with them for some reason, you can easily switch to a new therapist at any time for no additional price. Look at there, Vineyard Vines pants. Those like are a cool. blue ocean pants, that's pretty cool. And not only is it no additional price, but you can search for a new therapist without worrying if they are in your network or covered by your insurance. Again, I've been personally using BetterHelp for about three months now, and I have thoroughly enjoyed it. I've really connected with my therapist, and she's given me all sorts of really useful tools and information to help ease the burden of everyday life. So if you're struggling with something or you're just even curious to see what therapy is all about, consider online therapy with BetterHelp. Click the link in the description or visit betterhelp.com slash Harry Tornado. I have I have a how good did, feeling. I feel like we're about to hit a vein here. I hope so. We've got a Liz Claiborne hat. That's kind of cool. Greater good. Greater good. Huh. Made in India. And okay, so these aren't like that great or anything, but it's Airy. Airy's not a bad brand. It's not I bad. Guess. Not good. We had to take a little break to get the rain. The rain was super loud. Yes. But it's yes. better now. See, it seems like we have a lot of Ashley Stewart in this. Is that good? Um Lane Bryant. Not something that we've ever sold. We have our 
Oh, are these like the like? Uh, oh, the booby covers. Yeah. Oh, I thought these. Or maybe were they're like, like silic- silicone booby covers. Yeah, that's definitely. I thought it was what money. It it's definitely what it is. Save them. When I run my next 5K, I need those. Oh God, my nipples. It's starting. A little hydration A pack. A Discovery Channel hydration pack. Some PJs. Victoria's Secret PJs, though. Oh, yeah, those are good. So here's oh. a Olivia Moss ID card wallet. That's cute. And a little fan. Wow. Some, wait, oh, what is that? This? <gasps> oh, that's one of those. That's... Wait, is it? It's not the brand you're thinking of. Oh, yeah, not the, the Floch Raven. Whatever that's. I don't really I know what that is. I think we've sold that before, though. Yeah. It's a nice bag. Yeah. Yeah. What not? What not? Get this bin out of the way. Ooh. Ooh, what is silk, it? Still trash bag down there. All right. More women's clothes. Maya Bobble. Sheen Curve. This looks high quality. It feels high quality, doesn't it? Well, there's a V here. Oh, I don't know. Wild Fable. Uh, I was hoping this big athletic bin. Bayleaf? That's an Amazon brand. Avia. This is gonna be a good bag. This looks good like, bag right here. Well, what is that? I don't think so. This looks like a tree skirt. <laughs> That's a regular skirt. Look at it. Well, yeah, you'd wear that. Really? That's so pretty. Oh, I thought it was a tree skirt. You should keep that personal use. I really thought it was a tree skirt. Oh look, it's got all these real pearls on the bottom. Means we're all in this together. American we're Red Cross. All in this together. And... Zeus. So much is single stitch? Ciao, be Bella. Ciao, Bella Italia. Okay, let's do this. What is that? That's a grabber. <gasps> a shoe. Ooh. All right, what do we got? What is this? Oh, it's a cycling jersey. Cycling jersey. Giordana? Giordana. That's actually pretty cool. That is cool. It looks old, too. This could be an eBay item, for sure. Yeah, let's put that in the eBay, yeah. eBay bucket. Some men's pants, dockers. We're just not pants people. We are not you know? pants people. I just, I don't like taking pictures of them. Oh, what is that, Colhan? Clearwater. Oh, Clearwater, I thought it said Colhan. Mm. I don't like taking pictures of them. I don't like measuring them. Yeah, they're just, they require m multiple measurements. What is this? Faster, Faster. than a fly swatter. The get them. Huh. We'll play with that later. We've got a couple little bracelets on there, bracelets little cross here. bracelets. Little leather, leather stuff. So cute. A little watch. Rolex. Seiko. Seiko, really? Yeah. Huh, that could be good. It could be. I mean, not like, it's not like a thousand dollars or anything, but maybe like 40 bucks. Orange tag Levi's. Oh, wow. It's not the big E though, and they're, they're made in Puerto Rico. It's a little orange tab, those are pretty good. Lane Bryant, we got a Lane Bryant. Oh, what is this? Lucky motorcycle? Lucky brand, that's kind of cool. Pull out like one of these bags you keep open. Swim trunks, Argonaut, American Republic, new tags, like a little rugby polo. That's kind of nice. It's just like a cutter, cutter and buck golf sweater. Halloween costume. Ooh, what is it? Oh, it's just some tool. Black, yeah, it's just fabric. Tool. Fabric. All right, let's try. Let's try this bag here. Um, oh, Reebok, Reebok CrossFit. Is that CrossFit shorts? Yeah. This could be good. What's this? Senior, Senior. or Sorenex? Sor no, oh, Sorenex. Oh, shout out yeah. Sorenex. Sorenex. I mean, I don't think that's anything. I don't know if you guys so. know. Sorenex is a company here that make weight equipment. They made that gym over there. Fish pants. J Crew. J Crew fish pants. J Crew fish pants. Those are pretty cool. Wash pile. Yeah. Some shorts. Those are Columbia. Columbia shorts, 34. Some of this stuff is okay. It's just not, it's not exciting. You know, it's not what you'd buy if you went thrifting to try to find stuff to, to sell for a profit. Is this, nope, Market Spruce. That's like one of those Stitch Fix brands, I think. Oh yeah. Yeah, we Perf really thought it was gonna be more purses and Yeah, it other said stuff. like, it said textiles. So I'm like, maybe they threw some purses or hats or something in there, but it's been all closed so far. Victoria Peak the Secret. Pink yoga pants. That's kind of cool. Those uh, flares are back in style. The flares are back in style, just like the song. The flares are back in style. March of Dimes, Presbyterian College of Pharmacy. Ice cube. Ice cube, that's cool. Oh, these are not vintage, by the way. These are modern. I modern, know, modern I don't know if that yeah. was a, I can still set that off to the side. Tommy Bahama, oh, these are like Tommy, Tommy Bahama pajama pants. 
Yeah. Those are pretty nice. Columbia. Columbia. Columbia hiking pants. Nike. Nike basketball shorts. Josh is taking a break to play with the get em. I'm trying to figure out how... Uh, what? I'm trying to figure out how it works. <laughs> it's like a gun that you shoot. And it kills flies. Shoots flies, yeah. And then you put it on like that. And then you tie a string to it, and then you shoot flies. Mm -hmm. So I think we're gonna find something. Oh, that's stuff. the bag. That's the bag we've been looking for. Is this right the there. bag we've been looking for? Yep. Okay, let's that's try. That's gonna it. be the one. Let's try it. What is that? New directions. Right off the bat, new directions. Oh yes. What is that? Chanel. Some Kim, Kim Rogers. Rogers. Lots of Kim Kim Rogers. I don't think that was the bag, Josh. Yeah. I, uh, oh, Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. Winnie what is the that? Winnie the Pooh. Um, Toys R Us set. Oh, that's, that's so cute. cute. Yeah. Yeah. Put that on one up. Wait, is that all underwear right there? Is that all men's boxers? That's what it looks like. A whole stack of men's boxers. Yeah. Used I mean, boxers. Com comment on the video. Like, maybe I'm being weird, but like, I, I, that's not something I would ever donate to a thrift store. Like, used underwear? Like, that's yours. That, that's your own underwear. Yeah. You don't need to donate it. Like, you can donate if it's underwear. New, it's yeah, if it's new in the package, but like, used underwear, like, you wear it for a couple years and then. You know, you donate it. I, that's just not something I would ever think about doing. But maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Comment on the video and let me know. Do you donate your underwear to thrift stores? You can probably hear it in our voice, but Haley and I are both getting pretty defeated at this point. We're just going to have a last second <laughs> blitz. Oh, what is that Batman hat? It's very dirty, but it, I mean. I don't know, it's all like sun bleached. I thought I saw this and I thought that was old, but no, it's not old. It's just gross. <laughs> uh, oh, those are Nike. Are they? Nike, I think Nike those, golf shorts. Nike golf shorts. Those are cool. That is cool. That is really cool. Yeah, I like that a lot. I, I think they're, eBay, the, eBay those. Definitely Ebo those. E hey. Something smells like um, like wet. unwashed laundry. Yeah, it you smells wet in like, the bottom. I'm going to set you guys up right over here. Haley and I are going to have a last minute blitz in this box. And if we find anything interesting, we'll let you know. We'll let you know. We got a Snuggie. Is that really a Snuggie? Like an actual snug? Yeah, it's the little label. It's a snuggie, snuggie. you guys. Wash pile. Please, let's not make a humongous mess. We're just gonna lift the box right off the top. What? Are... Look at there. Now, now I can get in there. Got a cool little sports bra, shower curtain liner, 100% Piva, Ooh. which is really what you want to look for in a shower curtain liner. We got some Nike shorts, Nike dry fit, women's orange shorts. Twillery, is that a good brand of men's shirts? Twillery. Twillery. Oh yeah, this I is one of those two. like performance. They're like the stretchy. I think Twillery is good. Not, I mean, it probably retails high. I don't know what the resale market is like. Well, and we have two of the same size. Yeah, yeah. So that that's probably pretty good. We'll put that on eBay. Melissa Page, new and tag stretchy pants. That's okay, kind of cool. Okay. Steinmart, thirty dollars. Michael Kors, Michael Kors, a nice business trouser. Yeah, Susan Bristol, but it is 100% uh, wool and it's new with tags. Those are two good things. The Mizuno baseball thing. Is there any like team embroidery or anything on it? It says Mizuno. Yeah, we'll get that. Oh, we got some Under Armour shorts. Oh, we got more Under Armour shorts. Champion women's leggings. It's a pillowcase set, Mr. Right and Mrs. Always Right. So cute. Oh, Ralph Lauren polo button down shirt. This is really nice. Oh, looky here. Johnny O. Oh, okay. Johnny O button down shirt. I like that. With the polo. We've got a Columbia PFG. Nice. Decent. Bread and butter right there. Bread and butter. We have another Columbia PFG, which is just like a polo shirt. Polo. We have. Another Johnny O, checker, red and white checkered. And last but not least, we have another Johnny O. That's pretty good right yeah. there. That's a good good bundle. Yeah. We have another Columbia shirt, Columbia polo. Bowden? Bowden's good. Bowden shirt? Yeah. Yeah, like five of our last six Poshmark sales have been. Oh, look, look. Oh, Patagonia, new with tags. New with tags, Patagonia. That's awesome. Wow, That's and we really were gonna good. give up, Josh. And it's no. hemp. Yeah. This is Hyped Unicorn. Never heard of the brand, but it says Made in USA. So that could be pretty good. 
I have a few other shirts. I have another Columbia right here. And look it up. Wow, that. Masters. Augusta National. Very that, nice. Izod. Izod. Chaps. That looks like a shirt you'd wear. Yeah. And Adidas. Adidas long sleeve. The good stuff was at the bottom. The good stuff folks. was at the bottom, Josh. <laughs> Oh, this nice little Oakley t-shirt. That's pretty cool. Oh, got some more shoes in here. And I got some electronics. All right, the shoes actually, these are pretty good. Saucony? Oh, yeah. Saucony Triumph. Triumph what? I think just Saucony Triumph. Those are pretty good. Drew Strickland approved. Our friend Drew just ran 100 miles in Saucony's. Some more Under Armour. Shorts. Under Armour shorts here. Reebok men's shorts. Those are nice. Got zippers on the side. And another Under Armour. Army of 11. Oh, it's football. 11. Post Malone and 21 Savage Tour t-shirt. Cool. That one's cool. This is a funny shirt. It's funny. Nike. True, True Champion. True Champions, wow. Florida State. That shirt must be 10 years old. <laughs> oh, got some Vineyard Vines. It's a bathing suit. They cut the net out, but it's still kind of cool. Bathing suit with little the Vineyard Vine whales on there. Yeah. All right, so that's a $200 Goodwill mystery palette. Was it worth it? I don't know. I mean, I feel like, like we got definitely enough stuff, like the whole whatnot bin, like we're gonna make our money back on that right. probably. It just makes more sense for us to just go to the bins and yeah. cherry pick everything that they have in the entire store. But it was an opportunity that we couldn't pass up. Like we saw the, the Goodwill palette there and we were like, it's our roots. Like it's where the channel yeah. really started growing when we used to do this a couple years ago. So yeah, we're gonna, <laughs> gonna get all this stuff cleaned up. If you guys wanna follow us on whatnot, there's a link down below, you can do that. All this stuff will be in a future show. Uh, I think I think we did pretty well. You know, I think so. Yeah. The, the bottom of the box kind of redeemed the it top did of the redeem box itself, yeah. a little bit. So thank you guys so much for watching. You're the best. We will catch you on the, the next, next one. one.